Here is another confirming message for the cosmic event and what will transpire. You will instantly, without effort, be transformed when the earth is plunged into darkness. It is I, Jesus Yeshua, your Messiah, the Lion of the tribe of Judah, in whose breath I establish kingdoms and I subdue them. I am He, the creator of all things. I raise up and I lay low. There is nothing that has been created that was not thought of, designed, and purposed by me. I am He that speaks to you to warn, of th to warn you of things to come. I am He that prepares your hearts to receive revelation and mysteries, understanding and knowledge. This night I have come to share with you that it is upon you. It is upon you, children. Keep your focus. Stay ever so close. For very, very soon, you will engage in a way that you have not done before. This is the great unraveling. With great and terrible speed, the events come. I mourn for the loss that there will be of so many, but it must be so. Do not grow weary in the day-to-day -day training and task at hand, for in an instant all will suddenly change. I tell you this so that when all is spiraling out of control all around you, and people are in complete chaos and fear, you, my own, will know no fear, for it is I who will operate from within. I assure you, you have my complete peace. You will instantly and without effort be transformed, and from there will go on to carry out many, many things in my name, for this is why you are here. The darkness comes, children. It comes quickly. The destroyer is near. The earth will be plunged into utter darkness, and fear will reign. Terror such as the world has never known. You, my lights, will all be protected, of course, for you know this already. In this you have my promise. I tell you this, not to turn your attention towards events, for they will continue to escalate in intensity and frequency, and they will be terrible. But I tell you this out of my great love for you, so that you know that I care so much that I would warn you and prepare you ahead of time. So you would know that I am in every heartbeat and every breath you take, that we are not separated. I and you, you and me, we are one in the Father. Do not become fearful that you would not know what I would have you do when these things take place. For this I promise you as well. You will have my instructions very clearly and I will speak directly to your spirits. You will understand all that I say and all that I ask you to do. So once again I remind you, do not allow your minds to engage in a thought process that would take you back to the soul nature in that you would visualize these events and attempt to prepare your minds on how to handle these situations. This is not what I would ask you to do. Stay with me in spirit. Don't allow yourselves to feel what you think this will feel like. This will only serve to distract you. This is why I come and speak with you. I do this because I am teaching you. I am teaching you now before these events come. These conversations we have been having are some of the final instructions you will need. For I have spoken many words of love and encouragement and instruction to you. And wisdom. All to increase your awareness to deepen the revelation of all these things that I have been speaking about for so long now. Truly it is simple as what has already been said. Trust and obey. This is all you need to do. May I ease your spirits with one more thing. Do not overfret over things done or not done. Things not completed, timelines, things I have spoken of before. For all is in my hands, and I know what will be done and what will not. I know what your needs are and will be. All will be provided for. As always, do what you know to do each day, never striving, always abiding, knowing that I have the outcome. I put no pressure on you to finish anything that has been set before you. It is about the journey, not the end. Remember this. This is a wise, wise statement. It is about the journey. Everything you do is a heart matter. I see the motives and desires of your hearts, for I have placed them there. I wish you to seek me with all you have, regardless of what you consider to be accomplished or not. It is all in my flow. Just stay with me, children. It is that simple. Just stay with me. Be my voice, peace. In this place, sound the alarm. Repent, 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 for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Truly I come. Time is no more. Jesus Yeshua, in whose breath kingdoms are established and subdued.
and I will post the scriptures below. As with every word, I seek the Holy Spirit of God in your prayer closets and seek confirmation from Him and Him alone. Trust in no man and no woman, but put your full faith and trust in our risen King and Savior, Jesus Christ. Glory to God in the highest, for He alone is worthy of our praise. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ over this audio message and over any and all the Holy Spirit of God is led here to listen to it. In Jesus Christ's most holy, holy, holy name. Amen and amen.